What's the matter, mate? <laughs> you don't see Pete Sampras having a giggle break, do you? <laughs> yeah. Hey, yes! And the winner is the one and only Housley Moon. <laughs> oh, that is definitely enough exercise for the next decade. Oh. I think you're going to be sick. <laughs> 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 what made you think of that? Well, yeah, I just thought you needed cheering up. That's all. <laughs> what do you like, eh? <laughs> oh, I don't know. What am I like? <sighs> hey, how'd you fancy, right? A night at the dogs. You know, as friends. Being Freddy, you know, what the bunnies whizzing around. <laughs> oh, that's what I like to see happy faces. Been anywhere nice? Park. Oi, you've been at the park with your mummy. What's the matter? Nothing. It's getting big, isn't he? You had lunch, yeah? No. Right, we're well, coming to the cafe because you're not skipping that and all. <laughs> <laughs> Alfie, look after the stall for us. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. Jake, listen, it's me. Uh, that bloke, you know, that works down at Dogs. What's his name? Jimmy or Joe? Yeah, yeah whatever. But has he still owe you a favour? Oh, come on, you stupid thing. You know, they could put the man on the moon, but they can't make a till without a mind of its own. I'll get it. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. Sharon, I'm going to bring some bottles through. You went missing. I thought you might have gone and done something stupid. Well, like what? Well, like go and talk to Kat, for starters. She's gunning for us. Oh, yeah. No, I did that. What? Yeah, I went to see Kat. I got her to come back to my place, begged her forgiveness. And? And, you evil witch, something really funny happened. See, it turns out she couldn't give a toss about me. And I can't believe that I nearly let you drag me back into this whole scummy mess again. No, I don't know what Kat's told you, Listen, but... Listen, she knows that Zoe forgave me. Not you, Chrissy, me. Can I tell you something? It's like a big weight has been lifted from my mind. You've got as much to answer for in all of this as I have. Yeah, but Kat doesn't think so. You're on your own, Chrissy. Oh, that looks nice. <clears throat> Dear Cat and all, got here okay. Kelly met me at the airport. Drives like dog. <laughs> Took me to a kids' party she was doing. I beat the living daylights out of a piñata. <laughs> kids didn't get a look in. Anyway, getting on with life and you get on with yours. Top of to-do list. Cat, sort things out with Alfie. You were meant to be together. The world isn't right until you are. Love to you always, are we? Everything that's happened, and she's still looking out for me. How could I not have been here? I've really failed her and I. Well, you weren't tonight. No, because I'm selfish. You know, I just went off sorting my own problems out. If I'd never left Alfie, none of this would have happened. Yes, well, you are back now. And everything will sort itself out, you'll see. Yeah, but she still had to face it on her own, didn't she? Not completely. She had us, and oh, Chrissy was there for her too. Yeah, Chrissy. I still haven't thanked her properly for everything she's done, have I? Maybe it's time. Uh, no. Excuse me. Cat! Surprised to see me. No, I thought you'd be coming by. Alfie, mate! What are you having? Well, I'm having a word with Jake. Well, what are you having? I... I know how much you must hate me right now. I want you to know that I'm sorry for the way everything turned out. What do you mean, Den being dead and all that? It was an accident. So he must have told you. Yeah. You letting her think that she killed him. Was that an accident too? Okay, you've got to understand. One minute everything was fine and the next minute we were all up to our necks in it. I had to think fast. Yeah, you did that all right. It was a nightmare, Cat. All right, you know... You want me to say I'm sorry? Well, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I'm sorrier than anyone. I'm sorry the whole thing started. I'm sorry Zoe got caught up in it. But I didn't have a map of what to do when it all hit the fan. I did what I thought was best. For who? He was just lying there, and Sam and Zoe are looking at me like, you know, what are we going to do? Yeah, because they trusted you. Zoe trusted you to see her all right, and you didn't. And you didn't the next day or the day after that. You just watched her tearing herself to bits because she thought she'd killed someone when all the time you knew that you'd done it. 
She was your plan B, wasn't she? Oh. In case it went pear-shaped, you had someone you could stick it on. God, it's how you think of me. <laughs> I ain't even started what I think of you. Well, then it doesn't matter what I say, then, does it? Mind you, it doesn't matter what you say, either. Because there's nothing you can do. <laughs> now, you're going to pay for what you did. And every finger your scumbag husband put on my daughter. Oh, why? That was down to Dad. It wasn't down to me. Well, he's copped it, and he? So you get the lot, debts and all. There is nothing that you can do, Kat. I could pull your whole life down. Just a few choice words. No, you can't. Because Zoe's as guilty as I'm... Oh, is that right? Yes! She hit him first. So in the eyes of the law, she's as much of a murderer as I am. You cannot do a thing to me without dragging your precious little daughter into it. So he's safe in Spain. Oh, haven't you heard of extradition? No, probably not. Oh, is that the kind of mother that you are, Cat? Yeah, hands off. Don't mind packing your daughter off to a life on the run. Well, you see her once every couple of years. Shame she's such a weak little girl. Weak! <gasps> oh, she wouldn't last a day and you know she it! She ain't weak! She's innocent! Innocent! She kicked the whole thing off in the first place. She slipped with my husband, so don't see. <laughs> oh, is this it, Kat? Is this it? A couple of bitchy comments, but if, if this is it, we'll bring it on. But to be quick about it, because I've got a pub to run. It's over. No! No, it ain't over! For Zoe it is! She's come through everything you've chucked at her and come out the other side. But you're still here, aren't ya? You? You're happy, tucked up nice and cosy under the floor. Your daughter walking all over No, and... don't push me, <laughs> Why not? Cos you've got four! Yeah, full... yeah, I have, and you know what I can oh, do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mrs Watts in the pub with a doorstop, wasn't it? Split open his skull. I wonder what that sounded like. I bet it was like a walnut cracking or something, wasn't it? And all that blood. How much do you reckon? About a bucket full? Oh, I bet it made a real mess of the floor, didn't it? Must have been a nightmare. But you still wake up now, didn't you, seeing it? Or get used to it. Cos it's always gonna be there. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. All that swimming about up here. And her down there, swanning about like she owns the place. Poking about in all the wrong corners. <laughs> It's going to do your head in. And I'm going to be there every step of the way, enjoying it. So come on, Chrissy. <coughs> chop, chop. Got a pub to run. This is the first day of the rest of your life. Wow, oh, I am hoping I've got two cracking tickets for tonight. Oh, Oh, OK, not to worry. You know, we'll just go another night. No. It's a mistake. Well, I, don't, I, don't, I don't understand. A mistake? But, you know, the things we spoke about today in the park, I mean, was, was that just a dream? It was a nice dream that we both had in the park, but, you know, we're awake now and it's back to reality. Well, what reality? Because if this is about Kat... No, Because no. me and her are not going to no, happen. No, it's nothing to do with Kat. It's to do with... It's to do with... It's to do with Billy. I'm meant to be with Billy. Since when? Since always. You know, everything we've been through together, you know, real things. I can't throw it all away just for a dream. Even if it is a nice one. Sorry. Taxi, round one, defender.